back with the second week of our bear home learning pack and I'm so excited because I do like this week and I love Goldilocks and the three bears so here we go Goldilocks and the three bears so we've got daddy bear mommy bear and baby bear once upon a time there were three bears who lived in a house on the edge of a wood there was father bear mother bear and little baby bear. Every day the bears had, remember what they ate? That's right, in them bowls they had porridge for breakfast, but one morning they found it was far too hot to eat. Let's go for a walk in the wood while the porridge cools down, said Father Bear. Now, who was walking in the wood? A little girl called Goldilocks was also walking in the wood that day. She had wandered too far from home while playing. At last, Goldilocks came across the bear's house. The door was open, so she went in to have a look around. Mm. Goldilocks saw... What did she see? She saw the three bowls. She tried por porridge in the biggest bowl, but it was too lumpy. Yeah. The medium-sized bowl was too sweet, but the porridge in the smallest bowl was just right. So she ate it all up. <gasps> After eating the porridge, Goldilocks decided to explore. She went into the living room where she saw three chairs. She sat in the biggest chair, but it was too hard. The medium-sized chair was too soft, so Goldilocks tried the smallest chair. Mm. Oh no! The smallest chair was just right, but all of a sudden, crash, it broke into pieces. <gasps> Whoops. All of a sudden, Goldilocks felt very oh, tired. She went upstairs to find somewhere to sleep. There were three beds in a big bedroom. Goldilocks tried each of them and found that the smallest bed was just right. She fell fast asleep. I'm starving. When the three bears arrived home, they were very hungry. But something wasn't right. Someone's been eating my porridge, growled Father Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge, said Mother Bear. Someone's been eating my porridge, cried Baby Bear. And they've eaten it all up. And he was so hungry. The bears went into the living room. Someone's been sitting in my chair, growled Father Bear. Someone's been sitting in my chair. Someone's been sitting in my chair, wailed Baby Bear. And they broke it. Oh, I think I'd be sad as well. Stomp, stomp. Stump. Together the three bears marched upstairs to investigate. Someone's been sleeping in my bed, roared Father Bear. And in my bed too, cried Mother Bear. Someone's been sleeping in my bed, squealed Baby Bear. And she's still there. Goldilocks awoke to see the three bears. She said, she, she let out a loud scream. Goldilocks leapt out of the bed and ran down the stairs. She ran all the way home. And what did the bears do? They made some more porridge. The end. I think I'd be just as upset as Baby Bear, would you? Somebody had been in with your things and then they'd eaten it. They'd broken it. But she was still there. Now, 
This week, I want you to think about the size of the three bears. I want you to look at the size of the different bowls and the chairs as well. And maybe um, you could have a little go at tasting your own porridge this week. I wonder what you like in yours. See you again soon. Bye.